Quartermaster Outfitters. Now to call this store an army surplus store would really, really be doing it a disservice. One of the things you won't find in this store is antique army boots that have had a million kilometers walked in them and old threadbare clothing. But one of the things you will find are voodoo products. This is the Voodoo Tactical Matrix Assault Pack. Look at the size of this thing. This is one big, huge, badass pack. We're going to take a closer look at this pack today, explore some of the features that it's got, see if this pack's right for you. So let's have a quick start by looking at the outside of this pack. One of the great features that it has, look at that it's got little D-rings on the side, so you can hook things onto this, clip things onto that, has on the, a couple of nice pockets in here. Now one of the things I love about these pockets, look at that. That is a lined pocket in there. It's got stitching all the way around the outside and of course molly on the outside. I really really love the way this is put together. Each one of these pockets has really been thoughtfully placed and if you take a close look, look at the zippers on this, you'll notice that those zippers are not like a conventional zipper. They're almost the type of zipper that you have in a dry suit, something like that. So what happens is that keeps out the weather, keeps out the debris, things like that. We're going to have a quick look at the front of this pouch. Now I'd like to add that this is one of Voodoo Tactical's flagship packs. It is really big and it is one of their really, really nicest packs that they offer on the market. Again, it's got the molly strapping on the front. When we flip this guy open, look at that. You got a little clip in there. You can uh, clip a couple of different things on, your car keys or whatever. On the front here has the Voodoo Tactical Emblem. You can open this up. You can put things in here like your, it comes with a bunch of extra straps, things like that that you can use for different purposes, attaching things to the pack, things like that. Inside, look at the size of this pack. I can get my whole hand in that. Fantastic. It has a couple of little side pouches here too, which is great if you need to put anything kind of small in there. Look at that. It's got some molly strapping on the top, on this side, identical to the other side, but the pockets are a little bit different shape. Now you'll see we have the standard horseshoe one here like you have on the other side, but instead of just a small pocket on the bottom, take a look at this. Look at the size of that. Lined inside on here, which is great if you want to keep a thermos or any kind of lunch product or temperature sensitive product in there, maybe even your camera, whatever, and look at that. That is a nice, good sized pocket. Continue on to the inside, we're gonna open this thing up. And this, you could literally, this pack could wear me. Look at the size of that inside. Now right here, this is the cummerbund, which has some molly strapping on the side. That's a really great thing to have. Look at this, it's like a little wallet. You've got a little thing here with a key tag on it, you've got some little pouches there for your wallet, something for your phone, it just goes on and on and on. You really have a difficult time outgrowing this pack. Now you have a large padded pouch here, some really great padding on this pouch. You could put anything in here like a laptop, something like that. And right here, that's where your hydration bladder goes. It has two little hooks on the outside, right there for your hydration bladder. And of course on the outside has a little tiny port. Now on this particular pack, it only has a port on this one side. So you open that up, pull it right out. This is a huge pack. And the best thing is, even if it's too small for you, you can put some molly strapping on there. But look at the size of that thing. It is an amazing, amazing pack. Now this pack I own myself and it is fantastic. Cause I just don't think you could possibly outgrow this pack. And when we have a quick look at the front, look at that, what do you have? More pockets, more zippers, really fine quality zippers. Look at these little things to give you the idea of what they do in the factory. These are little tiny tie-offs that you have. They're attached right onto the zipper. These had to be inserted, tied off by hand. And if for some reason you need more storage space, you've got molly strapping along the bottom. You've also got more clips, more loops, 
more hoops. This is seriously a deluxe pack. Now this pack retails for well over $100, but it is worth every single penny. It's got all kinds of parts on the side where it can expand and everything else. You'd be really tough to outgrow this pack and to use and abuse it to the point where it's gonna break apart because they have a really good quality. They use a non-cotton stitching in this, so your stitching isn't gonna rot if the pack gets wet. What I also do with mine is you can take a waterproof spray, spray the outside, and it's gonna keep it a little bit more water waterproof than, uh, than leaving it the way it is. So if you need a pack that is going to be able to haul all your gear all around the world, the Voodoo Matrix is definitely the pack for you. You can have another quick look at how it looks on the back, how it looks on the side. Look at that. Really wonderful pack if you need to haul a lot of gear. If you're going out for camping or hiking or like myself, you're carting film gear everywhere. Really wonderful pack. I'd like to thank you for watching this gear review. I'm the Wolfman. Please consider subscribing.